Hi guys. Uh, as uh, if you had come from the last channel, which is uh, Devam Pandey right now, the channel name. And uh, as I uh, told on this channel uh, that I made this channel because the Fred MC and Freedom cheated on me. They didn't uh, pay me as well as I can't leave the their channel right now. And it's been a uh, two months. No, sorry, one month and uh, five days. But I can't leave that uh, channel partnership, which is very bad. And many of you uh, subscribe to my uh, channel are YouTubers, so beware. Though don't you take any partnership, just stick with the AdSense until you get any trusted source. Uh, when you grow a bit bigger, don't do uh, like me, cause uh, that channel now has uh, like uh, 800 subs, 900 subs, and uh, 3 lakh views or 4 lakh views but they are just waste right now i didn't get any money from that but i did get uh, one payment from my adsense account and uh, i bought this it's a u euphoria uh, which is a second company from the micromax and if you are not from india let me just uh, give a quick little review of this phone so the u company uh, is the second company of the micromax and here uh, as you can know the Micromax makes a bit shitty phones but uh, the U company has a uh, uh, pretty good points as you can see it's a uh, something around 120 dollar phone okay 120 dollar phone and uh, the build quality is very good and it doesn't heat up it's a uh, very cold as you can see aluminium chamfered body and very sturdy grip and the display 720p TFT LCD you don't get any higher AMOLED display like a Galaxy J2 or anything like that but it is very good but main thing of this device is it running uh, Snapdragon 14 which is same in the Galaxy Grand Prime but you can't overclock it more than 4.1.4 uh, GHz but this device is right now running at 1.9 GHz thanks to the velocity kernel and we'll show you in the CPU Z so the snapdragon chipset uh, in this device is bit different from the grand prime as you can see 1.9 gigahertz over here and also it's not running on 400 megahertz it's 650 megahertz which is more than grand prime a hell lot faster and uh, as you, if you know my android score was getting around uh, 23k which is same like the grand prime but the grand prime has a lower resolution display so more but this device has a 4 2 gb ram DDR3 which is same for the Galaxy S4 I don't know whether they has a, this has a DDR2 or DDR3 it's quite good but even after overclocking it didn't switch off like a Galaxy S4 or uh, didn't it get overheated but the Android score was a huge bump let me just show you it will take a bit to load as you can see 45k which is very awesome because you know, even on the Galaxy S4 can only score until 31k which is only the UX score of this device which is insane for this price you can't get more than this and even if you install a uh, Lenovo camera you get an option of uh, manual focusing let me just show you a bit quick bring something a bit closer and the device uh, screen might be seen a bit over saturated but it's just my camera and there you have it a manual adjuster for the focus which you do get on the Xperia not not any Xperia Z5 or so but you do get an LG G5 and a Galaxy S6 uh, which is insane for this price as uh, it has a any only 8 megapixel camera but uh, this option is uh, very insane so I just tried to install on this thing this device running a 13 MP rocking camera and we'll show you just went into the app let it load and as you can see no pro option over here or uh, uh, option for getting a manual focusing which uh, differentiates this device from the latest not latest 2013 flagship and also with the help of the kernels the LCD display ha has a bit cost of colors than the AMOLED but with the help of the kernels you can adjust the saturation too which is great if you don't want a, a over saturated device or so
so it's was a bit quick review for this phone which i purchased for you guys i will do many rom reviews and uh, comparison views as it's running a cyanogen mode 13 and it's very stable at this point we don't get a working camera on the galaxy s4 till now so i'll show you android version 6.0.1 which is cool this is running rom 98 by i don't know <laughs> the name of the developer but i use this device as a daily driver because it uh, doesn't drain that much battery on 1.9 gigahertz quad core then this thing this plastic thing <laughs> right over here oops sorry share so guys thanks for watching also subscribe to my channel if you want to see this device more and thanks for watching peace